My name is Brennan Perry. I'm a safety professional with SOS Safety Solutions, and I wanted to talk to you a little bit about some best practices involving knife usage and knife safety. The first thing that I wanted to talk about was that a sharp knife is a safe knife. The most common misconception is that the sharper a knife is, maybe it's more dangerous or it's, you know, unsafe to use because it's so sharp. The sharper a knife is, the safer it is as it goes through material and whatever you're cutting a lot easier, it doesn't require excessive force. The second thing that I wanted to talk to you about is proper cutting techniques and glove usage. So when you're cutting something such as an onion that I have here, one thing that you would like to do is place your middle finger towards the end that you're gonna be cutting, place your pointer and ring finger on each side and place your thumb all the way on the other end. Then you would simply take the knife and guide it through the material. As you can see, this knife is sharp and it requires almost no pressure. And my knuckle acts as a guide, keeping the knife away from my fingertips, reducing the chance for a cut. In regards to glove usage, sometimes people don't prefer them because they don't have the dexterity or the feeling that they might like. But when you're cutting maybe something slippery, such as maybe fish or uh, meat, things like that. Maybe it, it's a, a good idea to use a cut resistant glove in that instance in case of slipping or anything like that. The next thing that I would like to talk about is using knives as they're intended and that is to cut things, cut produce, meat, fish, things like that. Not using them as spatulas or turners to, to flip food on a grill or, or serve food from a dish. The more that you use knives for their unintended purposes, the greater the likelihood for somebody to be cut by them. And the last thing that I wanted to talk about was knife storage. When you're done using a knife, don't place it in a sink unattended. Uh, don't leave it out on the counter. Immediately take it to wherever the dishes are being washed, clean the knife and place it in either a knife block or on a uh, knife strip, something that keeps the knife out of the way and reduces the potential for somebody to either come into contact with it or pick it up and use it as it was not intended to be used.